name is Logan Jude Sunday. I hail from Neke Nisuzo local government area, born on the 9th of September 1986. Had my first degree in political science from University of Jos. Had my diploma in law from the same University of Jos. Have my postgraduate diploma in education from Federal College of Education, Puerto School, Yobe State. And my first school living certificate were in Anambra State. I currently work with uh, National Youth Council of Nigeria, where I serve as the head of new media. And in Youth Council, we are the voice of the youth and uh, we we'll, uh, formulate policies for the youth of Nigeria. Currently, in Youth Council, we are planning the first Southeast uh, Governorial Aspirant debate, candidate debate. And uh, the aim of the debate is just to bring the aspiring, uh, the governor aspirant to come and talk to the public of their policies and program and let the masses have opportunity of uh, questioning their policies and uh, scrutinizing them. I am the executive director of the Town Criers Initiative. In Town Crier, we are basically into the girl child education, empowering them and supporting them to achieve their desires and dreams. In the, we have a, a program we are currently executing, which we call One Moon, One Girl, One Part campaign. And in the campaign, what we do is we want to see a situation whereby we can help the girl child who are in the local villages or in the rural communities who do not have access to sanitary pad or napkin during their monthly flow, which we will find out that most of them uses dry leaf, ashes, old newspaper, and it causes serious infection to, the, to their private person. We want to see a situation whereby we can help them to pro provide sanitary pad. And it's not all about providing the sanitary pad. It's all about when you provide the sanitary pad, what do you do for the sustainability where you have no money? So we we'll still have to teach them some certain skills that will support them to, 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 to get what they need. And we still have another program which we are, that will take up by September. We will target support her. In support her, we want to bring at least 50 girls from the rural village and put them in the city school, in a boarding school, where they, because in those villages we are finding that they don't have access to good and quality education. So we want to support them to build that the woman in them, in her aspirations of being the best woman in the world, of being the best leader in the world. Because when you educate a girl child, you have educated the world. So we want to support the girl child in chasing her dreams, her aspiration, her academic, economic, and social life. That is why we initiate the supporter. And currently, in the Town Prayers Initiative, we are still part of the 2019 election where we go to the streets, hear views about people, about their politicians, what they feel about them, what they, they don't like about most of them. We've been to the marketplace educating them on why they should vote, why they should not say their vote, why they should shun electoral violence. And thank God for this Obama Foundation, which to me, I see as an innovator, as a social change maker, that this is going to be one of the best and it's going to be a blast on my brain because when I say a blast on my brain, I mean this is one of the best training I've been looking up to where I can have opportunity of meeting social change makers from across the world, people from different race, different origin, different culture, different belief, who will sit down together, let's share ideas, let's network, let's communicate to see what they are doing in their various places that are changing the world, what I think I've been doing where I have been finding it so low that I have not been achieving. We want to see how it's an avenue where I will learn from a lot of people, where I will have the privilege of meeting my leader I have so much admire, somebody I have so much love to have a handshake with. This is an opportunity I will meet with Barack Obama myself, where he will going to inspire a lot of us to come back and make changes in our different community. We know we have been making changes, but we have a lot of limitations. We have fears in us. We have a lot of doubt. But with this fellowship program, I know we are coming back home fully loaded to come and explore to the community, to come and impact our community, to come and teach the communities what they do not know. I think this is one of the best programs I think I have so much seen, read, and I know it's going to be the best program to impact me. Better than all other uh, fellowship pro programs I've been attending as a Rotarian, as a Rotarato, as a Junior Chamber member, as a Manual Club member. This is going to be the best for me. Thank you very much, Obama Foundation. Thank you very much. I most appreciate it.